The photo in the February issue of the Tropical Traveler shows a topless couple in an erotic position. Some have said the photograph is inappropriate in the magazine that is widely circulated on the island and is a popular publication for school children sourcing pictures depicting the island's beauty. Publisher May Wayne says the photo serves its purpose and furthermore the Sinusian public is not her target market. Every publication is directed at a target market. The tourist is my target market. The article, which is a lovely article promoting all of our local Viagras that men in St. Lucia and the Caribbean have taken for years and century, is what the article is about. And it's true. The photograph depicts what the article says. So if St. Lucian's mores are offended, that is not my problem. Wynne views outrage over the photograph as petty and says public outrage can be better channeled at worthier causes, such as the island's alarming crime rate or the prevalence of domestic and child abuse. A picture is worth a thousand words. It sells the article. It's selling my publication. People are reading it. That's what's important. And I think the St. Lucian youth and the St. Lucian public should care more about important things that are happening on their island and stop being so petty and hypocritical. As for the article and its accompanying picture, she says if given the opportunity, she'd do it all again. I would definitely run that picture all over again because that picture made you read your article. You. And that's the business I'm in. Tropical Traveler is a free monthly publication published by the Star Publishing Company. Lovely St. Amy, HDS News, Channel 4.